is a level 70 map based on the docks tile set. Much like Wharf before it, this is pretty much a straight line. It might have a bend or two, but you know exactly where you're going the whole time. Straight across. Um, it's an excellent level 70 map. I highly recommend uh, that you prioritize this as one of the uh, one of the maps that you clear uh, if you if you have a pool of 70s. Uh, it's straightforward. Uh, you're gonna get these pirate ghosts or ghost pirates. You get some dogs, some skeletons, that kind of thing. I know you don't. There you go. Uh, you also get like rocks and other such mobs that are kind of on these these docks types tile sets. But uh, it's a very good, very good straight map. Uh, the boss at the, is at the end, just like uh, just like Wharf that we did before. We're just gonna jump right to him. Uh, this map is uh, level 70, so it's kind of a gateway to higher level maps, and it's one of the better level 70s. Um, you know, a lot of them don't have really a good, clear, straightforward way to, to fully clear the map, but uh, you can't you can't go wrong with here. And the boss here is the Flame of Truth. Um, also known as the Fire Dog from Prisoner's Gate in Act One, um, he does uh, fire. He does attacks with added fire. Um, he, I believe, he generates and charges for himself. Uh, or maybe it's something else come with those frenzy charges, or is that just him? I can't tell. I think it's. I think that was something else that gave him those charges. Uh, but he has fire damage attacks, he resists fire, uh, and when you kill him there's a whole bunch of burning ground um, which can damage you a bit. Super super straightforward um, map. Uh, there's the fire damage. You'll see it degenerating. Uh, degenerated my energy shield quickly but doesn't really do enough damage to counteract my life regen. But that's Spear and thanks for watching.